What's up, everybody? This is Rob Shack. So today we're doing another race in my Burnout 3 Takedown series. This is going to be a good time. Thank you all so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Help me get to 1,000 subs. Try and get there by the end of the year. And as of right now, only 7% of my viewers are subbed. So we'd love a little, I'd love a little bit more of that. So now we're doing a Burnout 3 Takedown race. So this should be not impossible, but hey, who knows? We've done a lot in the last couple weeks. We've had some crazy burning laps that are not fun so yeah we'll see if we can do it um using a coupe looks kind of like a mercedes a little bit so i'm just gonna start pushing people around here bullying my way through slide it i was like that has to be a wall takedown i feel like that dude just lost complete control of his car all right so now it's boosted up um uh, missed everybody Let's hit this guy. Let's hit this guy. I like picking cars that have a little bit more weight, just because with, especially with stuff like this, you can actually like push people more. I'm trying to just like swing. Where do they go? Oh, there he is. Dang it! Can I, I mean, there's nothing I can do here. I'm stuck. Okay, so. Car's very very slow that I just picked up. Like the weight makes the weight to uh, pow the weight to what's the ratio here? I'm trying to think of. I guess weight to like top speed is a pretty big deal. But oh yeah, the nudging when you're a heavy car, you can pretty much just control the road, which is pretty fantastic. Um, makes it way more fun to be a heavy car because <laughs> you can like actually deal with people. Like when people run into you, they like. Like that. Like, I didn't even really do much to mess with that guy. And it's like, you know, we'll give it to you. It feels like they're just way more lenient if your car is, uh... If your car can just be heavy, you can just destroy everybody. Oh, shoot. Can I cause an aftertouch takedown by them hitting this bus? No? Is that not how that works? I guess not, even though so many people crashed into all of that. That was that was my doing 100%. Ooh. I got a signature takedown. Nice. Okay, let's just slowly... This car is not very fast, but it's... I mean, see, see, like, look at stuff like that. Like, I mean, there's nothing... That is just destruction when you... This car, being heavy, is very, very, very beneficial for races. Just bullying this guy. Oh, but now his friend is here. I think I just got another take down there. <laughs> the last second, somebody else went flying into that car. Let's so just... Push this out a little bit. Try not to hit anything. If I do, the best part about this game is the aftertouch takedowns, which are amazing. Stop uh, boosting just so we can... Save a little bit of juice here. Especially because we're going through this like crazy part of the map. No, no! I didn't expect it to be that right around that corner. Alright, so we're gonna retry that. Wait, seriously? You're not letting me retry it? This game can be unpredictable at best with stuff like this. But I'm gonna still just go and do that race again. Alright, well now I know that when we're in the little slow part, that's actually near the end of the race, so I need to be careful about that. It's stupid that they don't let you retry sometimes. It feels like they don't, it doesn't make sense half the time. It's like, oh yeah, we'll like, we'll give it to you sometimes, but not every time. I'm like, can we just, can we just have it where I don't have to go through all these menus? Like, this is cool to show that I got another signature takedown in Avalanche. I'm like, all right, that's nice. But I'm like, I, I didn't want to go through all of this. Look at what it is doing. 
I just wanted to finish that race and get a gold. I got invited to the special event in Europe. Yay, yay, yay. We're great. Go back to that race and do it again. I believe it was this one. Yeah. Silver check. But see, the, the the heavier cars, it's it's pretty fantastic. Even though, yeah, you slow down and all that, you can just knock people into walls and it's just like, yep, take down. Take down, yep, keep going, boom. We'll give it to you, give it to you, give it to you. And you're just like, thanks, thanks, game. You're just giving me all these takedowns that I feel like I don't need to get. But that's what happens when you're a heavy car. They, like, definitely respect people who tail, who, uh take these slow cars out for a spin because if you didn't you would just lose to everybody <laughs> okay everybody is dying haha -ha. just sliding around the road i think everybody every single person just got destroyed except for one one guy How was that a psych out? What did I even do to that guy? I didn't even touch that guy. All right, so let's catch up to the one dude who didn't make a mistake at the beginning there. Everybody else was involved in that major accident there, except for one guy who's up there somewhere. Gosh, going through this part of, the, of it not in a Formula One car is like actually fun. All right, so I just got him. Now we're going to wait it out a little bit. Here we go. I, I don't... I don't know how that was a takedown for me, but I'll take it. I'll take it. Get that one. Dude just came flying by me, but we got him. Let's try to get left here, I think. Are there cars coming? There is somebody right there. I, don't, I can't see. The camera is not very effective. But I think if I slide this way... Oh, that was a taxi. That was not a real car. Okay. thought that was an actual opponent that I needed to destroy. Yeah, I'll count that as a psych out. That one actually felt like it. Because he and I both went up the, over the jump, and then I just pushed him out of the way. Let's figure out where this takes four seconds ahead of me. Let's see how we do here. Still, still holding our speed, hoping that we're slowly gaining on this guy. Sometimes their AI just breaks. Yeah, he, he broke. The weird part about this game is when the rubber banding just breaks and then a car even when you're boosting fully just keeps going further and further away and you're just like well gotta start over there's no way but again that's not even that but big of a deal because again it's still fun to do this game so let's push all these people <clears throat> drift it up through there. Okay, let's just roll right up the middle here. I can't tell if I'm getting... Well, now I really can't see what's going on. What's on the other side of this? Thanks for the stupid camera angles. Okay, good, there's one. <laughs> The aftertouch takedowns are amazing. But yeah, the camera angle kind of gets all weird sometimes. I don't really know what that's all about. <clears throat> Alright, 
So now we're here. Let's just wait for somebody to come running up. Where'd he go? Okay, there he is. single person who was near me at that front just got destroyed. That definitely... Kind of proud of that one. I, I like actually thought about that. Let's get up to a higher speed here. Good to go. guy get away that that is weird boost boost car you're not boosting yeah. so the like the car like because it's so heavy it like does not know how to boost but it's the choice I've made But yeah, this car is basically just a giant bully. All right, this is where the race is almost over, so let's start holding down a boost to pat our lead here, and there we go. That was much better, and we actually won the race. So now we'll just see what stuff we won, and then we'll call it. So thanks for watching. Enjoy the rest of the video. Peace!